right, good culture, back at it again. All right, Mauser, Spanish, muzzle brake, Whitman, three, 140 grain, soft. Then we're gonna go two, 168 grain match. Slow burning powder. This is my test powder. Still testing forever, ain't I? Anyway, I'm kind of getting it down path. So I got a new location. Got a little bit more sun there because the other spot is in the shade. Hopefully I can see the hits. Okay, it's right on a little ridge there. All right. Yeah, it's already in the shade already, get that. So as I walk back over here, we're having shade already, folks. In the shade already. So, we get a little, it's about uh, 80, 80 degrees, 85. Beautifully set. Here goes the first shot with the 140 grain. I'm gonna pretty well aim on. See where we're at. Still to the right. Look at that. Now, I was hitting to the right before. And uh, we made we might have made some bad adjustments here. How's that? So we're gonna go. I'm gonna go three clicks. Three clicks to the uh, to the to the left. Yeah, my military left. Yeah, just before it and low. Okay. I'm gonna go two clicks more to the left. I'm gonna aim just a tad above the plate. Remember, this is uh, slow burning powder. 140 grains don't work too great. Oh, right where I was aiming. Still could have been just a tad to the right. One more click to the left. I was aiming above the plate, and sure enough, that's where it hit. So that one didn't drop. I got the uh, 168 grain. I don't, uh, these might drop. Let's go right at it. We're gonna aim at the same spot. Oh, yeah, they're low. They drop. I would have been, I would have been a plate hit if I would have brought that up. Two and a half to three mils. How's that? flying way up in the air you know what that was that was the can unbelievable <laughs> I seen the can in my scope fly at least 30 feet in the air so I either I hit right under I don't know what happened there I don't think I hit the can and it was low yeah that dropped definitely a slow charge there all right now should aim higher, but I would have been there. Okay, I'm gonna aim about a mil, about a mil and a half, mil. Uh, looks like I was to the left and low. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go with a flyer on that one. I'm not gonna make my adjustments. So. That could have been a flyer. I'm gonna go ahead and aim the same spot, maybe just a tad higher. Bingo! <laughs> Plate hit. I'm gonna I'm gonna call it quits right there. There you go. <laughs> that was a good one. I see the metal plate flying. That's definitely a hit, okay folks? <laughs> That metal flame went flying. Um, that was, um, how many shots? Seven shots, okay. Um, and this is the, this was what did it, the 168 match. Um, yeah, I shoot, definitely shoot a little bit better than a 140 grand. And probably holds a stability with the powder. I'm gonna go 175. I never shot 170, uh, 175 match to this before.
So eventually I'm going to reload some 175s, but the 168s are doing great. And uh, there you go. The can that went flying in the air, it was dyno that went flying in the air. Where'd he go? Uh, he went, I ain't kidding you, 50 feet in the air. There's a plate hit right there. I don't know. I, okay, here's the metal plate over here. It flipped. Where did it get hit at? I don't know. Oh, there's a. You know what? It appears. Yeah, that's it. Right there. It didn't penetrate all the way. Look at that. It just put a big because it flipped. Uh, like that. So that's amazing. It didn't penetrate. Dead <laughs> hit that plate. Dino, where? Oh, look at this. I put this, this can got ripped. So it was in like this. And as it got hit, it literally ripped the side of the can with this. That's it right now. Uh oh. There's the one dino. Okay, folks, I'm going to turn the camera. You're not going to believe this, folks. There's where the plate's at. We're talking 50 feet up this hill, all the way, and look at, I'm, I'm seeing, he's over here. We're over in this crevice. Wow. <laughs> oh yeah, but uh, we're talking some distance here. All right, one more time, here's the plate's at. The dyno was way over here, in that crevice probably about 50 feet away, so he went straight up and basically went way over there. He went 50 feet in the air.